Okay, for this quick tutorial here, guys, I'm just going to show you um, a ceiling plan with a drop ceiling with pot lights and so on. Let's see if we can do this. Right now, I have a camera in here, and if I just click on 3D view, and there's my shot. And um, not much going on. I didn't change the interior material of the wall or anything like that. Okay, so that's a little wide shot here. So as you can see um, in the ceiling here, we don't have a ceiling, so that's kind of exciting, right? So we need to do that. And <clears throat> as we discussed this earlier uh, in class, that we want to have a drop ceiling, two levels, and so on. Okay, so I'm just going to jump to ceiling level one immediately, right here. Okay, so I'm in here, and this is the space. You can see there's nothing going on. So under architecture, what do we have here? Roof, ceiling. Okay, so we're going to go to ceiling quickly. And I can do a sketch ceiling. So I can come in here and just take my rectangle tool really quickly, pop it in here. Okay, so that would be the beginning. Normally that's how we drop a ceiling in. And look at this, two by four scene, right? Okay, if I press OK, that's what you have. Now that's not an interesting ceiling, is it, people? Clearly not. So if I tab over here until this whole thing lights up, whoop, wrong tab, baby. Click out here, wait, one, two, right there. There it is. So I can always use the two by two grid to kind of design my layout. But we're going beyond this, okay? We're just going to leave it at uh, Jubrock uh, drywall, okay? So watch this. So that, we just change it from four, uh, 2 by 4 to 2 by 2 to drywall. But that's not my goal here. My goal is to actually do this just like we did the inlay for our floors. Okay, guys? Watch this. The minute I put a second rectangle in here, Revit knows that what you're thinking of is a cutout. Okay? We haven't this, this ceiling right now in here is at 8 feet. Kind of cool. I'll accept it. All right. There it is. There's, this is hollow now. So if I go to my 3D view, boom look at that let's click out so there it is this is kind of cool right okay clearly it's got to be higher I got to bring my windows down so I can change that to let's say nine or eight foot six something like that okay so back to ceiling plan level one grab this one check it out let's try eight foot six for now and see if we can work this out it might have to be eight nine and I'll go double check right now okay not bad so I can always bring these guys down okay nothing stopping me still height let's just change this to Space six, did it work? Ooh, I'm not sure. Did it? Yeah, it did. Kind of cool. I'll do that in here really quickly. Two space six windows are coming down. Eight foot six, not bad. I may just change this to eight foot nine, and Bob's your uncle. We'll be good to go. Okay, so there it is. Pop it up. Lovely. We're good. So we need to come back to ceiling plan again, and have our second ceiling here. Okay, much higher. All right, so again, back to architecture, ceiling. And this time I better be smart about it and just decide where I want this. I want this to be 9 foot 6. Okay, press enter. And sketch a ceiling. So check this out. I'm going to overlap here. I'm just going to come over here a bit. Okay, so we can do that. Oh, what am I doing here? Escape. Get my rectangle tool, of course. Let's do this faster. Clearly, you guys can do the exact size, but that's not how we like to do things here. I can come in here and pop it like this just really quick 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 and boom that's done modify a little tap on my right arrow one two done this part's not bad cool we're in and i'm really eyeballing this right now guys we should be more precise by punching something in here okay so good enough a little overlap i'm good to go all right awesome check done Ooh, scary stuff here ceiling is a t-bar ceiling that's not happening on my watch so let's change this to drywall quickly boom done okay awesome uh, back to architecture let's bring some components in here place a component what component would you like I do have a chandelier that my students here were kind enough to uh, download from Revit City awesome let's just bring it in here okay give it a second escape boom bring some pot lights next uh, component uh, did I bring any pot lights in here let me just check going going boom nothing so let's load the lights let's just bring some stock stuff lighting right here okay so far we're under five minutes this is cool internal please ceiling light yeah you know what these aren't that great but let's just down light spot that would be kind of cool okay let's go put this against the wall here going one. Ooh, yeah these are pretty serious um, let me space bar. Is it going to let me change it? Hmm. 
Not really. I don't like the, the look of this um, the rectangle. The space bar isn't actually rotating this, so I'm a little concerned. Uh, I would have to go ahead and edit. Uh, let's check another light right now. Boom. Sorry, wrong one, people. Uh, architecture, component, load, family, back to lighting, electrical, architectural. Uh, what is going on here? So sorry. I got to slow things down, people. Lighting, architectural, internal. Yes, please. Down spot. Let's just keep it simple. Boom. Okay. Oh, my God. It's the same thing. Cool. Spot it is. Let's see how this is going to turn out. One, two, three. And then one here. And there. And right here. Okay. All right. So this is done. Again, um, none of these. I'm just going to come back and put a couple spotlights in here. Okay. Component. One more time. Uh, I'm addicted to this uh, spotlight, it seems. We're going to change that really quickly. Internal uh, strip wall washer. Oh, man, these would have been nice. Emergency? No. Uh, linear box? No. Flat. Recess can. Yes. Let's go recess can right here. Boom. Okay. Open, please. Thank you. And let's just go. Line it up. Two. This is in the middle. You can, oh, we can always come back and uh, and let's just put it up one right by the entrance and on this side of the uh, escape. All right, good enough. 3D view. Let's check this out. Okay, so it's in here, looking all right. Let me change the shot. Okay, it's looking pretty good. Let's bring our lights in a touch. Okay, so let's do a render here, people go down here where's my teapot and quickly I'll just do uh, a medium exterior Sun not really Sun and artificial would work for me and let's do this render uh, perhaps I'll go to high and I'll pause it okay boom I'll pause now receive okay guys I had to quickly change this to low quality because the bell went as you can see uh, <laughs> this is really cheesy light here but it's looking pretty sweet from outside Clearly, we need to change the reflection on the floor. All that, and um, wow, I should change this. This looks pretty cool anyway. I need to change this chandelier business from the 70s. Okay, it's all good. Um, so you can see how simple this was. All right, uh, class is changing. Got to go. Thank you. Bellion out. Enjoy this one. Bye-bye.